Hello guys, it is Saturday and hubby and I are out and about going to Sam's. Honey, say hi. Hey guys. <laughs> yes guys, we are uh, headed into Sam's and I'm gonna take you with them. Oranges. And I said they got. I'm gonna do something. What's that? And what's that? Oh, these are navels. Are these oranges? Oh, they oranges. I thought they was grapefruits. They were kind of like grapefruits. How much is that? Seventy. They got a seventy. For six forty nine, which we don't need any more TVs, but they do. Oh, this is a clearance price. Oh. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a pit and table. Um. Right. Trying to think is there anything else we need out of here? I don't think so. That's a good deal on that bone, in that beer. How much is that creamer? Coffee creamer, 524. That actually is a good deal. Do you think I should try this? Cause this creamer is only like $5.24 and that's a big one. Mm -hmm. what are the ones doing? But I always get hazelnut. They don't have hazelnut, they have French vanilla. <laughs> you be drinking French vanilla coffee, right? No, I'll be drinking different coffee. I'm gonna try it. It's worth a try. We ain't trying none of the samples. We go up, you go up, yeah. Because you know you might like to try your samples. <laughs> <laughs> what you looking for then? No, the oh. test.
they have the patio stuff. I, I love this right here. That'll be nice in that corner. Did you say you wanted something like this? Oh, that's the pergola. Ooh. I like that color. Built in. Just want to plug up oh, yeah. That one four, but I kind of which one you like? This one. Get this for your uh, for that room for the that closet. Oh yeah, that would go perfect in that closet. How much is it? It's a kit. Oh, two forty nine. Two me two. Eh? Well, they only got one. Well. See that that third thing so wide. Oh yeah. So for each side, that's what you're saying. You have to go because you have to get one for two. Mm -hmm. This is just for one. See that pergola right there. I like that one. This one is nice too, and this was only delivered and installed for one low price. So they say you can get this and get it delivered and put up for five hundred dollars. Yeah, they said delivery and installation five hundred. That's how much it costs. Oh, that's how much it costs. The, the delivery and installation is $5. So you paying $2,000. Yeah. Oh, I see. So this is the cost of the gazebo, $1,500. For them to deliver it and install it, you can pay an extra $500. But if you just want to deliver it, you can get it for me. They'll deliver for ninety nine dollars. Mm. Mm. Which one you like the best? See, this one has a cover on it. You see that? Yeah. But see that this one doesn't. I wonder if you can um, like push it back, like remove it. You see, you remember some of them got like a shady thing. Mm -hmm. They got like a thing to. Run across it to make to make a color. Oh. Some of them do. I knew the one at Walmart did. Okay. Now we're at the Fries Meat Market. We come here to get our meat, as you guys know. If you've been with me for a while, we always get our meat here. Yeah. 
we're at Aldi's and we get ready to make our very last stop and then we are headed home and we'll be done shopping for our necessities and also we was picking up stuff for um we're gonna have our annual Super Bowl party at the house and we was picking up items for that also Did we have cheeses on the list? Yeah. Cheeses. <laughs> Did we need eggs? Get one. Get one. Aldi's always have some neat stuff, guys. They have a lot of items besides um, just food. And I always like to browse this section. Hubby don't like to come to this section, but I like to look and see what neat items or clothing they have. So we're just gonna walk through real quick.
guys, we made it back. Um, we stopped at how many stores today? Four. I know it seems like a lot, but we get specific things from different stores. So we made it back home to a quick grocery haul for you guys, show you everything that we got from each store. I have divided the items into each store and I'm gonna share, because we end up going to Sam's, the meat market, Walmart, and Aldi's. So I'm gonna turn the camera around and I hope you like videos like this. If you do, give it a thumbs up and let me know if you like, you know, day in life and grocery haul videos and I'll get some more out for you guys. The first place we stopped was Sam's and you saw us in Sam's. I didn't video Walmart because it was really, really crowded. And so I decided not to video any in Walmart, but from Sam's, we got our laundry detergent and this lasts us so long guys. And it cleans, clean the clothes really, really well. And even though I buy Glove Collaborative and I use their dish soap, cause as you see, I have their dish soap, but I, my husband likes the Dawn and we used to use Dawn, so we just still use it. And if I have dishes that you know are really, really, really dirty or anything like that, I tend to use my Dawn dish detergent. And then also for Sam's, we got some bowls and what was else we what else did we get from Sam's? Oh, my husband got some beer, but I don't have that here because we are having our annual Super Bowl party. So he got some beer from Sam's and then we just got these little Smokies. So we're gonna be making those when we do our little party. And then the next place we went was the meat market and we, we didn't have to get too much from the meat market. We just got three pounds of bacon. My husband got some pork chops and then we got some of these wings here for the party. We actually didn't need anything as far as um, the household itself for from the meat market because we did some shopping two weeks ago. So we just picked up these little items right here and these are basically for the party itself. So now we're gonna go to Walmart and we got some mouthwash, some Ziploc bags, and some aluminum foil, soda, some more Ziploc bags. Did we get these? Yeah, we got these from Walmart, the Ziploc bags. And oh guys, I forgot to show you, we also got this tray of cakes from Sam's. That came from Sam's. And we got this um, creamer from Sam's too because it was a really good deal. I think it was like four dollars and some change. And you know, I always have to get my shrimp when I go into Walmart. I love these shrimp. And then, what else did we get from Walmart? And I think that was about it for Walmart. And the very last store we went to was Aldi's. And from Aldi's, I got me two bottles of wine. And you know what? I was wrong. I'm just getting everything mixed up, guys. I'm so sorry about that. But we did get these chips from Sam's. So like I said, we're gonna start with Aldi's. We got some ketchup and ranch dressing, Italian dressing, barbecue sauce, some vinegar, um, some beefy onion recipe soup and dip mix. We got some mozzarella cheese because we're gonna be making some meatballs stuffed with cheese and rice, bananas, paprika, some pistachios. We pack those for our snacks for our lunch. Then we got some uh, smoke snack sticks. These are for my husband. I really don't eat those. And these muffin, mini muffin chocolate chip baker street. These are so delicious. Let me let you guys get a good look at these. These are so delicious. Really, really delicious. 
Then I got some cheeses. These are my favorites. I usually take these in a little Ziploc bag. That's why we got these bags right here. The little snack bags because we put our chips and our cheese it and stuff like that in those bags and take them for lunch and then we got these sweet and salty um nut snack bars and two cans of tuna bread wheat bread and then some eggs yeah guys that was about it we really didn't need too much we just got some you know basic items that we were missing in the house and some items for our super bowl party and i will be filming that for you guys and that is about it oh and we did get two See if I can get this right. We got two things of water. So that was it. Guys, that's it for the grocery haul. I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up, comment, share. But most of all, subscribe. I would love, love, love to have you a part of our YouTube family. And yeah, that's about it. Like I said, if you like videos like this, give it a thumbs up. And comment down below. What are your favorite stores you like to shop at? I try not to, you know, overspend. We always make a list before we go grocery shopping just so we won't be just picking up random items that we really don't need. And you have a tendency to do that when you're in stores. And we also try to set ourselves up on a definite budget for food every two weeks or monthly. And you have to make that, um, you have to accommodate it to your family size. It's just my husband and I, so we, set our grocery list uh, according to how we eat and you know we take our leftovers to lunch so we you know shop accordingly to that so basically i'm saying is you grocery shop according to your family size and how much you eat and what you would need to sustain your family for the next week or for monthly some people shop monthly we do every two weeks and at one time we did shop monthly and it worked out really good but now we do it every two weeks and set yourself a budget of the, of the amount that you only going to spend on food for that pay period so like i said guys if you like videos like this give it a thumbs up i didn't um keep account of what we spent next time when i do a video like this i will keep account of the amount that we spend i usually do that for you guys i'm short sure I am so sorry I didn't do it this time. So yeah, guys, I will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.